What's up, guys? Shane with Finley here. Uh, we are at Malk at a very exciting practice with Nancy Keeley, our Athlete of the Week. Congratulations. Thank you. Now tell me a little, it sounds like you guys played Kingman and you had a really big game. What, what constitutes a really big game in volleyball? Um, I think a lot of it is the energy and just making, like, when everybody has their energy super high up, that we just have to keep up and really just stick with it. And Very good. Going. What do you think, Coach? I, I agree. When their energy's high, they play really well because then they go after a lot of loose balls, which they might not normally otherwise. And so if they do that, then it hypes the whole team up and they're all Very, excited. Yeah, energy's it. huge. Yes, Almost could hit by a ball here. If they hit us with a ball, I think it was on purpose. So. <laughs> Um, and I'll tell you, I, I don't know a lot about volleyball in particular, but I, did I read that you had a whole lot of consecutive serves? Yes, I think I had 17. 18 in a row, actually. 18 yep. in a row, so yep. I do know that that's good. Yeah. <laughs> so that's great. Tell me a little bit about that. You just on fire? Is that pretty normal for you? Um, what happened? I think it's all in the ball, the kind of ball I have, but, um, <laughs> but I don't know. I just, I've been working on my serves a lot lately and just getting consistent with them. And I guess it finally Is that the most yeah. you've ever had in a row? Yeah, for sure. That's pretty amazing. What, that's what's that the like? Most, the whole, I've, that's the most in a row that anybody's had since I've been coaching here. Yeah, so I, I don't awesome. watch a ton of volleyball. When I do, I don't remember anyone hitting the ball 17 times in a row. <laughs> yeah. So that's, uh, or 18, I apologize. Yeah. No, so that's good. Now you are a multi-sport athlete, mm -hmm. and we have met before for softball. Yes. What do you think? Is this now your favorite? Mm, it's kind of bouncing around. <laughs> <laughs> Depends on the season, right? Exactly, exactly that. Um, I can't tell you that anymore. No, yeah, well, it's one of the not, other. We always say you can't, but you really can't have more than one favorite. So mm, it's yeah. like me and cookies and brownies. I just say they're both my favorite. So yeah. uh, what do you guys got coming up now? What's what's next on the agenda for the team? Um, well, tomorrow we have trivia and prep. And then Thursday we have River Valley. And then this weekend we have a tournament in Ashford. Oh, any of those games at home? No. All on the road? You got a road warrior at, huh? Yeah. That's no fun. What do you like better, road or home? I I like playing away. Yeah? Uh, you like I the road trips and getting like, out of school? Yeah, that is what I think. <laughs> but I also like kind of staying home because I hate going back home really late. Yeah, that's true. That's really rough, especially on some of those long trips and you got to come back in the middle of the night. Yeah. So. And that's what we'll do on tomorrow against Trivium. So yeah. it'll be a late Where's night. that? Down in Phoenix. Phoenix, oh my goodness. In the middle of the week? Yep. Who booked that one, AD? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> well, congratulations. This is this is for you. And we're making plans to see you in the softball season, but maybe we'll see you again at the end of the volleyball season, too. Yeah. So awesome. congratulations. That is for you. We're going to get a quick picture, but you are Athlete of the Week. And we're actually starting to put you up on billboards now. You'll be in the paper and on social media. So check right, it out. Awesome. Thank you.